This video is filled with electric rideables. From the Silence S01 electric motorcycle to an American-designed forward-facing electric scooter, we'll even show you the recently crowned world's most expensive EV ever. But first, you can now consider the world of water sports revolutionized with the introduction of the Takuma Ito, the first self-controlled electric towing watercraft. Set to create waves with its remote and innovative self-controlling feature, this watercraft follows and even comes back to you, offering a new level of freedom and control for surfers and other water enthusiasts. It's kind of like having a personal water chauffeur allowing you to control and progress at your own pace. The Takuma Ito is designed to handle a range of water conditions, from flat water to open ocean swells, thanks in part to its twin propulsion system. This adaptability makes it an ideal companion for leisurely outings and adrenaline-fueled adventures. Its advanced technology ensures a smooth and consistent pull, acting as an extension of your arm and enabling easy maneuverability. The Ito can reach impressive speeds of up to 28 miles per hour and boasts 85 minutes of tow time, making it a powerful ally for exploring unknown spots and pushing your limits. The Takuma Ito's capabilities were recently showcased on the popular YouTube channel, Sikos. In the video, the team used the Ito in a variety of conditions, demonstrating its versatility and performance. The Ito effortlessly towed team members, and they even let Sikos superstar at Max Moses give it a go, and it was, ah, well, let's let you give it a view. Oh, let me up. Did you sell that, or is that real? Oh, it's not that deep right <laughs> Say hello to one of the best-selling electric motorcycles in all of Europe. The Silence S01, a Spanish-made light EV, is an electric motorcycle that gets over 80-plus miles of driving range. The 9-kilowatt max output electric motor that drives this baby is cleverly housed within the 14-inch rear wheel, which leaves more room for storage. It also comes with a mobile app that enables riders to check their charging status, review ride history, and track the current location of their motorcycle. Another great feature is the trolley-style removable battery, which quick releases, sprouts wheels and a handle, then is ready for transport to the nearest power outlet. The scooter's dual offering of high battery capacity and significant underseat storage is an uncommon combination in electric motorcycles. And now for a genius innovation in the electric scooter world. Introducing the Tor 2 electric scooter from the London-based startup Tor. You see, unlike traditional scooters where the rider rides side stance like a snowboard, the Tor 2 features a forward-facing riding stance with foot platforms on either side of the frame like a skier. The updated second-generation scooter has larger, wider wheels and two different models. The standard version has a 26-mile range, while the Plus model has a remarkable 39-mile range. A 500-watt rear hub motor enables a top speed of 24 miles per hour, which can be speed-limited to match the laws of the country it's shipped. The Tor 2 also has other features including an LED display, smartphone mount, GPS tracking, integrated lighting, turn signals, and more. The scooter's aluminum frame can also be folded for easy storage, providing a compact solution for urban mobility. Holy shnikes, flying cars are real, or at least cars with drones strapped to the roof are. This is the Xpeng Aero HTX3, an electric vertical takeoff and landing vehicle that integrates intelligent vehicle technology with modern aviation, representing a significant step forward for advanced air mobility. Developed by Xpeng Aero HT, an affiliate of Xpeng Inc., the X3 recently achieved a significant milestone by receiving a conditional permit from the Chinese government, allowing it to continue its flight operations. This makes it the first manned EVTOL vehicle to receive such permission. And the X3 is more than just a flying car, the brand claims. It's a solution for short-distance mobility needs. It can function as a conventional car as well as fly over obstacles, providing a versatile transportation solution. 
But what do you think? Are we heading towards a future where flying cars are the norm? Or is this just a gimmick destined to be canceled quicker than culture? Let your thoughts do a cannonball into the pool of comments below. Attention city slickers, eco-warriors, and thrill seekers. Yamaha is set to electrify your commute with their latest e-bike offerings, the Booster and Booster Easy. These aren't your grandma's e-bikes either. They're like mini e-motorcycles moonlighting as eco-heroes, getting people out of their cars and onto the electrified streets. With a top speed of 27 miles per hour and a range of 68 miles, they're perfect for zipping through streets like Flash on a caffeine high. But perhaps you're looking for a more chill version. The Booster Easy is a toned-down option with a top speed of 15.5 miles per hour and a range of a slightly higher 75 miles. Both bikes feature a unique honeycomb frame design and come in two colors, aqua and tech graphite. Prices start at 3,300 pounds, or roughly 4,400 US dollars. Who knows? Maybe it's time to join your local e-bike community with an e-bike as unique as you are. Meet the Terran, an electric off-road expedition vehicle from Peak Evolution. Designed for extreme outdoor adventures, this all-electric expedition vehicle is the perfect blend of power and prowess. The Terran is built on a conventional multi-purpose transporter, but transformed into an electric powerhouse, showcasing not one but two Bosch 120 kilowatt motors. And while most electric vehicles rely on the grid, the Terran generates its own energy through solar power, ensuring a reliable energy source even in the remotest of locations. Peak Evolution isn't just talking the talk either. They recently put the Terran to the test, racing at the legendary Goodwood Hill Climb race. But the company has set its sights even higher, planning a solar-powered expedition to the highest volcano on Earth in an attempt to break a world altitude record. If they do beat the record of 21,962 feet, we'll be sure to report on it here. Yet another great reason why you should subscribe to our channel. We give you inner access to the world of electric rideables and electric vehicles, so don't miss out. Thanks. Prepare for an electrifying revelation in the world of luxury cars. Automobili Pininfarina has unveiled its latest masterpiece, the B95 a name set to echo throughout the annals of automotive history. And with a price tag to match its grandeur, it's touted as the world's most expensive electric vehicle. The B95 is the world's first all-electric Hyper Barchetta, a coach-built celebration of Automobili Pininfarina's Pura design philosophy. This stunning vehicle is a testament to timeless design, powered by pure electric horsepower capable of delivering sub two second zero to 60 times. Beneath its sleek exterior, the B95 shares the same powertrain as the Battista, Automobili Pininfarina's first vehicle. Elegant, bold, beautiful, and innovative, the B95 embodies everything that defines a true Pininfarina design. It's more than just a car. It's an experience, promising to deliver pure driving pleasure. But just how much does an experience like this cost? Well, the B95 isn't just the world's first all-electric Hyper Barchetta, it's also the world's most expensive EV ever. Brace yourself. This piece of automotive artistry comes with a staggering price tag of 4.4 million euros. That's about 4.8 million US dollars. Finally, a unique offering in the electric skateboard market. What you see on your screen in front of you is the Too Swift All-Terrain Inline Two-Wheel E-Skateboard, and it's redefining the electric rideable playground as we know it. At the heart of the Too Swift is its unique two-wheeled inline design. Unlike traditional skateboards, this design allows for enhanced agility and maneuverability, making it suitable for all sorts of terrain. Whether you're cruising down city streets or exploring off-road, the Too Swift is built to handle it. It's more than just a pretty face, too. It's equipped with a powerhouse motor that delivers a thrilling ride and a Molisel lithium-ion battery that delivers 21 miles of range, ensuring you won't be stranded in the middle of your adventure. Some people have described it as a hands-free electric scooter. As the founders at Too Swift have shown, innovation doesn't always have to mean reinventing the wheel. Sometimes, 
it just means putting a new spin on it. And truth be told, I totally might have to buy one. Up next is the Veerboats X13, a promising new player in the boating industry. Built with the same lightweight material as modern kayaks, this boat is designed to navigate off the beaten path and in shallow waters with ease. What's more, the motor is a Mercury Avador 7.5E, a cutting-edge electric outboard motor built to allow anglers to explore untouched areas. This, combined with the 1 kilowatt hour battery pack, makes the Veer X13 a practical choice for both first-timers and seasoned boaters alike. Mahindra Motors, India's leading automobile manufacturer, has unveiled its latest marvel, the Thar E. This electric SUV concept is not just an extension of their beloved Thar series, but a revolution in its own right, setting new standards for electric vehicles. It's part of Mahindra's Born Electric range of vehicles, which will include as many as five new electric SUVs by 2026. This electric vehicle concept breaks away from the traditional Wrangler look that the original Thar was known for, marking a fresh design direction for the brand. Interestingly, the Thar E will reportedly feature VW-sourced electric motors, indicating a collaborative approach in the development of this electric SUV. This strategic partnership is likely to enhance the performance and reliability of the Thar E, making it a formidable contender in the electric vehicle market. In fact, the Thar E is a testament to Mahindra's commitment to sustainable mobility and innovation. Move over Godzilla. It's time for Boardzilla. With its four large pneumatic tires, the EV4 City Board, lovingly referred to as Boardzilla, commands attention and promises an exhilarating ride. These oversized wheels not only offer improved stability, but also ensure a smooth ride over various terrains, be it city streets or rough off-road paths. Under the hood, Boardzilla houses two powerful 2,500-watt motors, delivering a combined power output of 5,000 watts, enough to burn rubber and reach top speeds of up to 25 miles per hour. But speed isn't the only thing that Boardzilla has to offer. With a range of up to 25 miles on a single charge, this beast can take you on long, thrilling rides without needing frequent recharges. Adding to its appeal is the skateboard's intuitive control system. The EV4 City Board comes with a wireless remote control, allowing riders to effortlessly manage the board's speed and direction. Shift Robotics is transforming the way we move with their innovative Moonwalker electric shoes. This groundbreaking wearable mobility device from founder Shunjia Zhang is not just a pair of shoes, but a testament to the power of technology in enhancing human capabilities. The Moonwalkers, touted as the world's fastest shoes, are designed with an instinctive AI drivetrain that allows users to walk at the speed of a run. Fitted with a brushless DC motor, these powered shoes can boost walking speeds by up to 250%, enabling users to cover more ground in less time. Manufacturing the Moonwalkers has been a journey of innovation and refinement for Shift Robotics. Before arriving at the final product, the team went through numerous prototypes. Each iteration brought them closer to their vision of creating a mobility device that seamlessly combines speed, safety, and convenience, bringing us one step closer to a world where walking can be as fast as running. Chevrolet is making waves in the electric vehicle market with its latest offering, the 2024 Chevy Blazer EV, an all-electric SUV that boasts a new exterior and an exciting interior design. The Blazer EV is built around GM's Ultium battery technology with an estimated range currently stated to be between 247 and 320 miles. The new Blazer also features standard EV features like one-pedal driving and region on demand which increases range by converting kinetic braking energy into electricity. The release isn't without some controversy, however. Chevy recently announced they are dropping the $45,000 base Model 1 LT trim, opting to start production with the $60,000 AWD RS model. This price point marks a significant increase from the initially announced base version price. 
Despite the revised pricing, the Blazer EV offers considerable value. It is available in multiple trims, colors, and battery ranges, allowing customers to choose a variant that best fits their needs. And if you need to know more about this electric rideable itself, it comes with a 17-inch interior display, split-folding rear seats, and a 0-60 to 60 time of just under 4 seconds. That's quick enough to keep up with a base Tesla Model 3. Not bad. But hey, perhaps you're looking for an EV that can tank turn like the Mercedes-Benz EQG. Or the latest moped-style e-bike offering from San Diego-based Ride One Up. Be sure to check out these and more in this next video. And if you haven't already, please be sure to subscribe. Thanks.